Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to another Atlanta Brickco haul video. We've got a couple things upstairs to look at and a bunch of figures downstairs, so let's get started. We've got some Technic over here. Looks like a built, what is this? Lamborghini, very nice. It's a lot smaller than the big one, but it's a lot more affordable, I'm guessing. You've got a, a hidden side shrimp diner here. It's pretty cool. I like that little mini build right here. Got some Garden of the Galaxy, a little bit of Marvel happening here. Um, some boxes of some mechs over there. Down here, we have uh, Lego Ideas International Space Station box. <laughs> There's nothing there. We've got uh, some Hall of Armor, Transformation Chamber, some smaller Star Wars built. I see an Ecto-1 down there. I think that's the desirable version of it, too. Um, some more clone tanks and uh, uh, Stormtrooper tanks, other stuff like that. Over here, this is a really nice set. We have the Bone Demon set. It appears to be sealed. Has some amazing glow-in-the-dark pieces. I actually got this set, uh, I want to say like a year or two ago, and it is absolutely worth it. So this will be going online very soon. Keep an eye out for that one. We also got a bunch of other sealed sets that are kind of put around the store. I'll try and cover those in another clip in just a minute. Got a, a kind of a hodgepodge of built sets. Uh, some of them more broken up than others. Some of these smaller ones look like they're still together. We'll put them all out for sale. The other ones are probably going to end up possibly as bulk or as is sets. So keep an eye out for those. Oh, Nerf Dart. A bag of minifigures and it appears to be some sort of set down here too. But you got some Knights of Ren, Batman, Omega, got the Emperor, some Harry Potter characters, some friends. Ooh, a tribal warrior from Indiana Jones. That's nice. Yeah, a couple good figures in there. Look at that. That's pretty sweet. And then a bag of, there appear to be even some next tonight's nice. That'll make some people happy. And then a bunch of kind of generic city figures in there too. Some bulk brick and a few semi sets. These books are interesting builds, I'm sure. A uh, bunch of Friends stuff. This is usually how we get our Friends sets. They're just a pile of colorful bricks and plates. And uh, this is probably going to go into the bulk, and that'll be very good bulk pieces because the colors are awesome. And, um, over here we've got some smaller bagged sets. Some of these look like non-Lego, so we'll have to go through these carefully. Yeah, that's some Halo down there. But I do see a Resistance Y-Wing here. Maybe some more Star Wars below it too, yep. ATST Raider, some uh, Harry Potter, yeah. But uh, a little light on the built sets, which is fine. We do have a few more sealed ones around the store. We'll go check those out in just a second. One of the nicer sealed sets that we got recently is this Diagon Alley. Looks pretty awesome, has a ton of minifigures. And Joe, is this one retired or soon to be retired? Still retail. That's a good price point to have though. So keep an eye out for this one. Uh, hopefully it lasts a little bit longer, but yeah, we've got it retail here right now. We've got a couple new Marvel sets that have just arrived here. We've got the final end game battle or end game final battle, excuse me. This one is pretty cool. It's got some good characters, nice little bit of rubble from the, the last scene in Avengers Endgame. This one I've seen around in places like I've seen it at Costco, at Lego stores. So that's easier to find. This one's been a little trickier to find just because the Spider-Man characters are very collectible. And it is a pretty cool build with the kind of copper colored Statue of Liberty. So that one's pretty nice. These have just been added. So keep an eye out for these. We also got some more Lego Dreams sets. So I'm excited about these. We got a couple of Nightmare Shark Ships and the rocket what is this one called here mr oz's space bus uh, it's not a rocket it's a space bus obviously but this one these two are probably the coolest sets from the dreams line this awesome nightmare shark ship super scary looking great minifigures pieces over here we've got the space bus this one includes the best character who is of course albert in his little space suit so keep an eye out for this set joe joe what is it what do we got here a built dream set. Oh, that actually looks great. It's, it's actually pretty cool. I like the colors on this. This little weapons rack, rack here. That's and it's got the weird lady inside it. Is it removable roof, maybe? I'm sure. Oh, wait. There looks like go. it is. There you go. I like the palm tree on look top. Look at that. Look at that. Dude, these pieces are insane. 
get the little oh. lady figure. Yeah, yeah. Oh. She's a custom torso yeah, and arms. She's so weird. She looks so happy though. It's great. Yeah. So that's we just got that in. Yeah, isn't that's that awesome. neat? So very weird cool. stuff. You're talking about dreams, so I had to interrupt. Yeah. That we just got that one built. That'll go out for sale very soon. Woohoo! All right, we're down here in the basement, and we've got a couple buckets of figures that have arrived over the weekend. We can check out this one here is particularly interesting because we have some classic pirates, blue coats, and red coats here. So I know our Blue Coat and Red Coat fans will be having a vivid discussion about the merits and virtues of both. But uh, Forest Men are clearly the best, and that's why I'm looking at this figure here. <laughs> but some Islanders, some newer Marvel. I also saw some UFO hiding in there, and that's exciting to see. Yeah, just a bunch of weird mix of new and old there. Um, we've got some Shima and City over here, as well as some Hidden Side. So a couple good things there. A little bit of, uh, ooh, is that a Nexonites? It is a next night. So, a couple of the stellar Lego themes here as well. I also see a classic space, red spaceman with a great torso. It also looks like it's an original because that is the thin chin guard. Pretty fun. Some old Anakin Star Wars figures, the yellow Star Wars figures, Ninja, Extreme Team. This is a bundle of awesome stuff here. Friends, more hidden side, Blacktron, Explorians, Life on Mars. Yeah, a lot of great themes being added in that bin alone. So, down here, even more of the same. It seems like we have some older stuff. There's some more red coats. I saw some rescue, very underrated, unknown theme. And then a bunch of city figures on top. Some Ninjago hiding in here, too. A little bit of space, fire station. It's like an Aqua Zone helmet being added to Ninjago figures. That's an interesting combination. Down here, we got a little bucket of um, Phase One clones, a few stormtroopers. There's a Yoda figure. Looks like he's in pretty good shape. Super battle droids, some Imperial officers, some good Star Wars figures being added there. Down here, we have some DC and Marvel. I see Red Hood, Magneto, Captain America. Got Hulk. So, a couple Batman figures as well. I even see one Power Miners rock monster hiding down here, too. So, that's fun. Randy has been gone for a week, so all these dinosaurs have been piling up, but we still got a bunch of these added here. Some of the big flying ones from the last Jurassic World movie. So, those will be brought upstairs and added online soon. Got a bag of uh, Lego Batman movie figures here. Another bag of built ones, and some Lego Movie 2 series figures added here too. So yeah, lots of stuff being added online. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We'll be doing lots of live streams starting early this week. See you then. Bye-bye.